I'm really excited to have with us today the CEO and the Chief Operating Officer from MyMedLab.com, Sheila Lawrence and David Clymer. Welcome, you two. Hello, Cheryl. Good to be here. Hi. <laughs> Welcome, Sheila. So, David, um, you know, it, it really is great to have my med lab uh, be one of the first live FAQ uh, frequently asked questions. Uh, I get a lot of questions uh, from people when I talk about using my med lab. So, thanks for joining us. Absolutely. It's a great opportunity for Sheila and I to answer some of the, the most common questions and give everybody a little bit better idea of what we do here at my med lab. So, we're glad to be here. Perfect. Let's get going. So, David, I'll start with you with kind of one of the basic questions. What is My Med Lab? We would explain My Med Lab as a digital marketplace where all the, the best labs in the world all come together in one place for the consumer. Um, we, we currently provide uh, testing from about 15 different labs, um, including labs in your local area, uh, especially labs around the country and around the world. And our job here at My Med Lab is to uh, bring them all seamlessly together in a, in a private health record for you. Um, we're currently offering hundreds of, of tests uh, to U.S. consumers, about uh, 30 tests worldwide. And really the goal of, of what we, we're doing here at my med lab um, is, is to get you to better understand what your health is like today. Um, that's the beauty of lab tests. They tell us what's going on on the inside, their objective, and uh, you know, then to be able to take what those numbers, your own personal numbers, and put them in a private health record so that you can begin to uh, track how your health changes over time, uh, over an entire lifetime. I think the most important thing that, that we're doing um, as a company is that we're, we're helping you, the consumer, prepare for your next doctor's visit. Uh, we put a, a video. Let me get that screenshot for you. Um, we have a video on the front page that does a pretty good job of explaining uh, uh, how the process works, um, but uh, I think you know all of us. Uh, we're all middle-aged here, and I think at some point, what happens is um, we start to understand our own mortality. We start to understand that it's much better to try to prevent disease than it is to try to fix it once we have it. And uh, a yearly checkup is a great way to try to keep on on top of that. Unfortunately, what happens today uh, in healthcare is that you know we we wait a couple of months for that appointment with our doctor. We wait a couple of hours inside their office, and we finally get in. We get about five minutes with our doctor. Um, they they tap on our knee, look in our ear, and send us to the lab. And I think what happens in many cases like that is you know we uh, we, we leave that that office visit thinking, wow, I just, you know, what a what a colossal waste of five minutes. I didn't know what to talk about. I didn't know what to ask. And a big part of what my med lab's designed to do is to help you prepare for that process, um, have have your your labs, your baseline labs, your numbers, um, and to be able to have a, a really great conversation and have something to talk about uh, so that you can really make the most of, of the time you spend with your doctor. That's awesome. Um, so the next question I think that really leads into this is, do I need an order from my doctor in order to purchase a test from my med lab? And the answer is no. Um, a doctor's order is part of uh, the entire package of the, of the services that we provide. Um, all our tests include an order from a licensed physician in each state. Um, it's the same uh, medical team and group that's going to review all of your results before we release them back to you. Perfect. So, um, you know, you mentioned uh, hundreds of tests uh, in the U.S. Do you provide testing in every state? Almost every state. Uh, we, we're currently uh, providing tests in 45 states. There are uh, five states that, due to existing laws, that kind of limit um, the consumer's ability to kind of engage in that process um, that, that don't allow direct-to-consumer services. Uh, New York, New Jersey, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, and Maryland. Um, these five states uh, uh, don't allow our process to be available there. Um, the good news is for uh, residents of those states that um, our orders are good across state lines, so they can uh, uh, go to a neighboring state, they can uh, visit a collection site while they're traveling. Um, you don't need an appointment, so all you have to do is show up with your order to be tested. Fantastic. So now that I have all the options and I know I can do uh, order the test without my doctor's order and in just about every state, uh, my med lab is available. How do I find the test that's right for me? Well, we've we've spent a great deal of time over the last ten years, um, you know, making the process as simple as possible. 
I got a screen. I got a screenshot for you here in the red box that shows up on the uh, our on the opening page. Um, we've basically broke down the the uh, the basic panels or what we call a baseline into uh, four choices uh, based on specific you know your age and your gender, male or female, under or over forty. And uh, these tests, these panels include the same test that you'd have in a comprehensive yearly physical with your doctor or uh, that the insurance company would do when you were applying for health or life insurance. Um, once you have this basic uh, block of tests, like I said, what we call a baseline, um, you can personalize it with any test um, that's specific to your current health or your family history. Um, you can, uh, you know, what we're helping you build is, is a healthcare experience that's personal to you. So individual tests can be found in, the, in categories on the left-hand side of every page and uh, you can search for any test by name in the search bar on every page. Perfect. So um, you mentioned hundreds of tests. Can I get any test that I want from my med lab? Um, no. Uh, out of the hundreds of tests that, that we've uh, developed, uh, that we've, they've been selected by our health experts um, over the last 10 years to basically ones that could deliver you know, quality health information directly to the consumer. Um, if a test is questionable, uh, as far as the information it can provide, if it's too complicated, uh, too sensitive, you know, for the average consumer to make uh, informed healthcare decisions, we just don't do it. We leave that uh, relationship, you know, we leave that test uh, to the relationship with their personal doctor. That makes sense. Hey, Sheila, um, when I'm on the my med lab site and in the checkout process, and I know you're going to maybe shed some light on this, I see the the term test and and then I see panel what's the difference between a test and a panel the difference between a test and a panel a test is a single test when you're ordering just one test by itself a panel and I'm going to do a screen share with you is where you actually are ordering more than one test And here is the vitamin D 25 hydroxy test. The online price is $80, and the add to cart button is the red button here. You would just simply select it if that's the only test that you are needing. Uh, below it is where it gives you the panel price, you, where you get a lower price because you're actually creating your own panel. Anytime you have two tests or more, that's considered creating your own panel. It is $65, and you would just simply select the Create My Panel green button here. Then it actually takes you to our next page, which is called Create My Panel. You can scroll down below here. You will see uh, listed upon categories like arthritis, uh, hormones, thyroid. You simply select the box next to the testing that you're needing. And if you do not see the testing that you're needing in this short menu, select the view all. It will actually pull down a much larger menu for you to select find the test that you might be needing. You just select the button. And then you will look up here. You can see where all the tests are that are in your cart before you actually check out. And if there is a test that you were looking for that you did not find below, you can go right here to search and type in whatever the name of the test is that you'd like, select the search button, and then it will find the test for you. Perfect. So that kind of leads to the next question. Um, I know a lot of um, parents are, are wanting to experience it for themselves, but also maybe for their children and maybe for their uh, older uh, parents, as we, as some of us are kind of in that uh, situation. So, can I order tests for other members of my family under my account? No, you cannot order tests for other family members on your account. Each person must have their own account uh, because whenever you are ordering and whenever it processes your digital lab order, that prints out the user's name and date of birth on it. Those items are things that at the collection site, they check that, and if it is does not match the person that is needing the testing, then they will not do the collection. So can we at least share an email address? No, an email address cannot be shared. On our site, the email address is your username. So therefore, you have to have your own email address for each account. Uh, you can, if someone needs an email address and they don't already have one, you could always go to uh, Google Mail or Gmail or Hotmail and create a free account. 
That way they would have an email address, so then therefore you can go on to MyMedLab.com and then create them an account on MyMedLab. Uh, both accounts, there's no charge to create the account. The only fee is whenever you actually are purchasing testing. Perfect. David, uh, here's a question for you is, do I get to go or can I go to any lab for the blood draw? Um, well, my med lab uses a technology both on your desktop and your smartphone the, that uses your location or your zip code to show all the location uh, collection locations within a 50 mile radius. Got a screenshot here that uh, uh, shows that in the red box. Um, uh, our connection to LabCorp gives us about 2,000 locations nationwide. Uh, once your order is approved, you can you can immediately visit any of the lo locations listed here at your convenience without an appointment uh, during their normal business hours. Uh, you simply print out the digital lab order and take it with you when you go for collection. Perfect. So, um, Sheila, is there? You talked about um, the account is free to set up and uh, you're only charged when you order a specific test. Is there a fee for the blood draw? No, there is no fee for the blood draw. The price that you will see on our site for the testing, that's the only fee that you're charged. So that price includes all the way from ordering the test to the blood draw collection, all the way to receiving your results. There are no hidden fees. Everything is included in the test price that you see. Fantastic. So, um, David, I know this is one of the, the big questions uh, for a blood tests of people who are used to getting them from their doctor or through my med lab. Um, will the lab order from my med lab tell me whether or not I need to fast? Yes, each uh, directly in the, uh, the box that has your uh, specific information, as you can see it here on the left-hand side of the box, um, right below your uh, personal information, it has uh, fasting requirements and a yes or a no. Um, and it's also listed in uh, each one of the test descriptions as the first line. So if, if uh, either one of these uh, require fasting, basically what fasting means is nothing to eat or drink other than black coffee or water uh, after midnight the night before testing. Uh, this is going to ensure an eight-hour fast. Um, you know, some place between an eight and 12-hour fast is the optimum. And uh, uh, it's easy for to figure out which test it is that uh, need that requirement. Fantastic. I think you know the the having black coffee uh, option is is a was a surprise to me when I heard it. So uh, I think most of us think that fasting is just water. So for you coffee drinkers out there, um, just black coffee though. All right, Sheila. Um, when I go to get the blood draw, do I need to print out the digital lab order and take it with me? Yes, Jill, you do need to print out your digital lab order. I will show you an example of a digital lab order. Um, on here, it shows the patient's name, date of birth, and like as David said, it shows whether you need to be fasting or not. Uh, the important part here is right here. This is the order number that the lab or person will enter, and that will pull them up in the system. Also, it lets them know what testing you're having done, what type of requirements that they have as far as what tubes need to be drawn. Whenever they type this into the system, it lets them know that there are no, no fees charged to you, so that lets them know you've already paid for the testing. Then down at the bottom of it, in case they do have any questions, we have uh, instructions here for them and also our uh, direct number so that they can call if they have any questions or problems. So, um, David, what if I already have my own um, doctor's order? Can I still use it with my med lab? Uh, absolutely. Uh, like I said in the opening, our goal is uh, is to strengthen the relationship with your doctor, not to replace it. And uh, part of that in our commitment is that we've made it possible for you to be able to use the order that you already have from your doctor. Uh, Sheila showed you how we can how you can find tests and build a panel. It, it's a pretty simple process. Um, as you go through the process of purchase, uh, here's a uh, screenshot in the order confirmation page. There's a question that with a uh, checkbox next to it that says, um, I have my own doctor's order or no, I want to use my med labs. Uh, so you simply just check the box that you have your own. Uh, to, in order to be able to do that, there's uh, four basic pieces of information that you'll need, which is doctor's first and last name, um, the doctor's in pen or the provider number. Uh, these are usually on the order, not always. 
uh, most importantly, the doctor's fax number, because uh, once you put this information in, when, when your results complete and they've been reviewed and ready for you, uh, you get a copy and uh, we, we automatically fax a copy to the doctor's office. Um, the, the other uh, piece that would be involved in there is the diagnosis codes, and you can supply those as well. And then uh, everything, your order inside the MyMedLab system will have all your own doctor's information on it. That's fantastic. So I guess we've, we've figured out what the difference is between a panel and a test. Um, we know how to place an order. We know how to take it into the blood draw. Now, how do I get the results, and will I understand them once I receive them? Um, yes, and, and I have a, a screenshot. We're, we're very proud of the uh, uh, how we've um, been able to take a complicated process like your health and to try to break it down into something that the consumer can understand. Um, when you'll, you'll receive an email or a text when your results are complete and ready for you to review. Um, you simply log into the your, your private MyMedLab account to see them. Um, for most of the tests that we provide, the, you'll see the, the simplified version of results on what we call a personalized health report um, that highlights the, the important values like blood sugar and cholesterol and others. Um, the initial report groups are, are grouped into uh, uh, easy thing categories like uh, diabetes, heart disease, they're around specific uh, body systems like liver and kidney. Um, each group uh, is scored either green, yellow, or red uh, based on, so green are, are all the values in that um, one piece like diabetes, all your your typical uh, values looking at diabetes are normal. Um, yellow is a caution alert where you have at least one of the values at a range. Uh, red is that you know a, a subject that you need to discuss with your doctor. Um, when when you've looked at the the, the short version of it um, by clicking the uh, see the the full lab results, um, it will take you into where you can see uh, the entire. Uh, lab results with all the values and once you have uh, more than one value in your health record it's going to graph all of the same values together and you know this this allows you to be able to see your numbers as they are today but also to be able to track them over a lifetime and watch how they change uh, as we get older. You know that is so great I think people who know me know that I'm, I'm kind of a, a geek for analytics and so having an analytics about my own health and tracking that over time is, is just an amazing thing. So um, what if I need a more specific test once the results are done? Sure, I have this uh, screenshot up here where uh, one of the things that we do different than everyone else is that um, we're already uh, providing the ability to do follow-up tests on the samples that are already at the lab. So you have a limited time once your results come back uh, yeah, some usually about 24 hours to add certain uh, uh, follow-up tests based on the initial results. So, um, you know, when certain results are out of range, they need to be followed up with more specific tests. We've actually built a protocol and the ability um, to do that, and not even require you to, for you to have to go back to the lab to have that drawn. Um, you simply uh, check the box for the follow-up tests. Uh, they get ordered, and they and they'll show up in your uh, in your uh, health record the following day. That is awesome. So um, so does um, my med lab, David, does my med lab actually interpret the test results? Um, once again, what, what I said with the goal with my med lab is, is not to, you know, it's to strengthen the relationship between you and your, and your personal doctor. It's not to replace it. And a big part of what we do with direct access to the tests is to help you make, you know, smarter choices. So um, what we do in, in between that time and, and what I in a, in a system that we call pre-care is to help you prepare um, for that next doctor's visit and part of that process is to allow you to, to speak with experts who uh, can help you interpret what those results are to better understand them and know what questions um, and to build a plan to move forward with your own, uh, your own personal doctor. So once your results are back um, you can see here in the red box uh, there are multiple buttons that allow you to purchase an expert review. Uh, when you, by pushing these buttons, you get to see. Uh, when you click these buttons, you see all of the experts that are um, tied to a specific area of your health, uh, whether it be thyroid or or gluc, you know, diabetes or heart disease or whatever. These experts can be doctors, nurses, authors, uh, other people who you know have a special uh, have shown a you know a, a 
an expertise in certain areas of your health and wellness. Um, when you purchase the, the uh, when you click the purchase a review button, um, like I said, you'll see all of them around your results. When you find the expert that you want, um, you can uh, purchase the time off of their schedule like you would purchase uh, seats on an airplane. Uh, at that time, at the time you've chosen, the expert calls you at the number you have in your account and you actually review results in real time and then the entire conversation is recorded and it creates an MP3, uh, MP3 file on your permanent record that you can listen to as many times as you need. Now, is there a way to share my results with my doctor? There is. Um, built, into our, uh, built into your private record um, is a way for, our, for you to simply share the results with whoever you choose. You own these results. You decide where they go. So once your results have been reviewed and released to you, um, you can simply uh, click on the button that says fax to your doctor. Um, we encourage all of our, our patients to, to build that relationship stronger with their doctor by sharing it. You simply click the fax button, you type in your doctor's fax number, and you can uh, fax it from directly inside your record with no additional software or hardware required. Um, you know, once again, these results belong to you and you decide where they go. Perfect. Sheila, will my doctor recognize results from my med lab as valid results? Well, because my med lab is a marketplace for the best labs out there, uh, the laboratories that are do performing the testing for us is the same laboratories nationwide that the doctors are using also. The difference is my med lab is a marketplace, therefore we are out there negotiating a lower price for you, the consumer. Perfect. So um, kind of the next question is, can my doctor fax my lab order directly to my med lab? Yes, your doctor can fax your order to my med lab. They can fax it to 888-377-6733. You can simply select the help button on our site if you need to refer to that to get that number again. Um, simply have them fax the order to our office. Uh, along with that, we would need a little bit of patient's information as far as phone number or email address. That way, once we have that order ready, we can contact the patient, let them know we have the order ready. They can look over the order themselves and then go ahead and purchase the testing. Excellent. So we talked about purchasing tests. Um, what forms of payment does MyMedLab accept? MyMedLab accepts all major credit cards and debit cards. If for some reason someone needs to arrange for a different type of payment, they could simply call us. Uh, they can call our phone number 888-696-3352, or that's 888-MY-MED-LAB. Wonderful. So David, um, why do tests have uh, three prices on them? Sure, that's a great question. Uh, I think Sheila's uh, spent some time on that already. I'll show a screenshot here of, uh, of the, the three prices. Um, part of what we do is uh, uh, we've developed an online process to make that's simple enough for everybody to use. Um, and it's the most efficient way for us to deliver our services. So when you use that automated system, we provide a 10% discount for using it. So you'll see the online price. Um, and then uh, the, the second is the panel price. I think Sheila spent a little bit of time talking about the difference that the panel price means that when you when you tie two uh, tests together in a panel, both of them get cheaper. And then uh, for those that need help placing the order, don't have internet access, um, uh, they can still reach us by phone by calling the call center to have us uh, help them place the order uh, without the discount. So, you know, my med lab is perfect for small business owners like myself and, and people who um, either have a limited insurance or no insurance at all, but uh, there are a great majority of people who do have insurance. Does my med lab accept insurance? Um, we don't at this time uh, as a payer, um, but, you know, we're a direct -to consumer provider that uh, is usually delivering the, the test for about 50 to 80 percent less than you'd pay at the lab without us. Um, we can do that because when everybody pays a time of service like you buy every other uh, thing you buy it in your daily life, uh, we only have to charge you for your test. We don't have to charge you for yours and everybody else that didn't pay. 
um, consumers with uh, health savings accounts or flexible spending accounts from their their employers can uh, easily use the debit card directly on our site or they can also uh, print out the order receipt that we provide with each order uh, and and use it to file for their own reimbursement so um, that you mentioned reimbursement will my insurance company reimburse me for my med lab orders um, you know, this is the sixty-four thousand dollar question in in healthcare. It's it's one of the reasons why the insurance, you know, uh, is, is such a big game and and such mass is that you know, it's really impossible for us to say whether they will pay or not. Um, what we try to do instead is we try to provide a, a a high quality product at a reasonable price. We let you decide whether that service has value or not. Excellent, Sheila. Um, how do I get a paid receipt for my order? Okay, well, I will uh, share with you on my screen. Uh, on my MedLab, once you're logged into your personal health record, you'll see there's different tabs here, my profile, my orders, my results. Under the My Orders tab, uh, then you'll see Lab Orders. That's where you get your digital lab order, but right beside it is where Order Receipts is. You look down here, and it shows you the order number. And it says Download Receipt. You just simply download the receipt, you can print that out, and there it is. Wonderful. Well, thank you both so much. I've got one last question, but I wanted to let everybody know how they can get in touch with My Med Lab. First, um, you can go directly to the website at mymedlab.com, or you can connect with them on Facebook, uh, at facebook.com slash mymedlab, or follow them on Twitter. Uh, hopefully, they'll, you, you both will come back and join us uh, for future live FAQs. I think this is uh, really great information uh, for the future of healthcare. So, David, I'll ask the last question uh, to you. And what makes my med lab different than all other labs? I get all the hard ones. I get the first one and the last one. Uh, I think the best answer is that, you know, like we've tried to explain in this whole process, is that my med lab is a marketplace. Um, it's a place where you can um, find out information about your health from all different labs and 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 build a panel out of tests from different labs in one space. Uh, ones that require a doctor's or one that require a blood draw show up on your digital lab order. You can go to the lab, have them done all at one time. Um, tests that require a kit to be collected at your home show up three to five days later. Uh, you collect the kit and you send it back. Uh, what everybody should understand is that all these results from all these different labs all come back to, to create a, a private health record that you own that you can share with your doctors and, and those, uh, those trusted health care providers to take a, a more active role in your health and uh, you know, improve your health that way. So really creating a, a more informed or a better informed consumer in, in regards to one of the most important things and it's, it's all of our health, right? Absolutely. I, I always tell people that the one common denominator in all your health is you. So when it comes to a record, a private record that you can use to, you know, to like I said, not only find out your numbers today, but track how they change over a lifetime and to be able to share them with those who can help you and hide them from everybody else. That's perfect. Well, thank you so much, Sheila Lawrence, COO of My Med Lab, and David Clymer, the Chief Executive Operating Officer from My Med Lab. Thank you so much, you guys. Have a great day. Thanks, Thank Cheryl. you, too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.